All right, here we are in the infinity free control panel. We simply going to scroll to the file manager. The file manager is where our files are located for our website. Here's our root directory. In order to load our web pages and the files associated with it, we want to go to htdocs. All right. Here we're going to load in all of our files. For our home page, we will load it here. It's hard to see right now, but there's index.html located underneath my photo. I also have images folder and CSS and anything else that you want to add associated with your website. Now, let's say I wanted to create a... Um, have another website or a project, I'll simply create a uh, folder. So when I click the new directory button, new directory or folder, new folder is the same thing, directory and folder, same thing. All right, so new folder name. I'm gonna try to install WordPress, so let's, go, let's name it WP. Uh oh one this wp one was successfully created and here it is shown here double click on it it takes me to that folder okay let's take a look at the website Let's go to WP001. Here's the default page showing up here. Here's the directory listing for WP001. Back in the control panel. We're going to use Scriptaculous App Installer. Says I'm not logged in. Uh, well, we'll save that for the next video.